better. Much better. All right, y'all, you ready? <laughs> Our group is the weirdest for sure. You're absolutely correct about that. <sighs> well, uh, here goes nothing, y'all. See what we can do. Here goes nothing. Runs good or bad, it doesn't matter. I don't have a Discord for uh, my stream or anything. Because, I mean, I don't have, I barely have any viewers, if that's what you mean. Yeah, it's it's free. It's pretty free. Like missing like I had a really bad logo, missing a red Z lot. Did I have any other huge mistakes? I can't think of any really big, big mistakes. Yes, the viewers I do have are, are at least like good ones and loyal, so that's cool, and that's all I care about. That's all that matters, y'all. Oh yeah, here we go. <sighs> Yu-Gi-Oh? Heck yeah. He's played Yu-Gi-Oh all the time back in like junior high. Oh yeah, man. Yu-Gi-Oh is the stuff, dude. All day. Favorite card, Red Eyes Black Dragon. Let's go. Ultimate Obedient Fiend. That was my trump card. <laughs> 3,500 attack. Like 3,000 defense. Let's go. Alright. Yeah, Yu Gi Oh! was the stuff back in the day, dude. The show was dope, like, everything, man. I didn't actually get to see all of the show. Like, I stopped, let me think about that, right after Battle City. So, I saw Duelist Kingdom and Battle City. But then I didn't get to see, like, the one with, you know, uh, Yugi, like, fighting Yami and all that other stuff. Like, does that make sense? Um, yeah, I have some of them. Like, my roommate bought me Yu-Gi-Oh cards for Christmas so we could play. There's, like, a whole bunch of the, like, Red Eyes variation things now. It's it's kind of weird. Like, there's, I don't know, they were... they None of them had, like, good attack points, really. But, like, they looked cool. in just a second. <laughs> and yep, now those people play Magic. I feel like Magic is way nerdier than Yu-Gi-Oh, dude. So, I don't know what they're talking about. 
making fun of you. Ooh, fusion ones? Okay. I got you. My DA is extremely high right now for some reason. Like, these guys are running at me. Kind of afraid for Del Lago. <laughs> I hope that this one thing of damage is enough. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Seems like everyone's really aggressive right now. I'm so happy about that uh that follower alert dude. I'm so happy about that. Got a when I come up with a uh I don't know, I'm a, I'm a I'm gonna start using some SpongeBob ones for just everything. <laughs> SpongeBob's the stuff. <laughs> Always ask the conch, dude. Gotta ask the conch. Throwing away a chance. Uh, that's funny. That's pretty funny. That was a weird turn, but alright. Wipe, what time is it for you, dude? It's gotta be 5 a.m., right? It's always 5 a.m. Like super late over in Germany. I mean, you're not wrong, Suki. You're not wrong. What do you prefer to be called? Because you said like you know, the Zelda community calls you Zora, and then we call you Suki. So which one do you? The time's down there, but it's not visible at the moment, so I just guessed. I was like, 10 o'clock? That seems about 5. <laughs> I feel like that could be like a commercial. Or like a power bar or something. Like, feel the conch! <laughs> at your local GNC deal. <laughs> Magic conch. Cool. Whatever rolls off the tongue. <laughs> One. Two. Three. Four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Get ready for this glide, y'all. Get ready for the super glide. Anti disestablishmentarianism? Anti Alright, I got you, dude. I'll call you that. That's, that's no problem. <laughs> Claude success. <laughs> Wow, my some of the best segments like jumped out so quick from that. One twenty three thirty, like it like skyrocketed down, like nose dived.
Come on, Leon. Thank you. Bubble Buddy. It's his first time. Once again, congratulations. Yeah, when it comes to the SpongeBob quotes, dude, all day. Like, me and my friends. Heck, even my sister. Everyone. Everyone's all about SpongeBob quotes, dude. Good gravy, he's naked. Like, Spongebob 1999 through 2003, golden age. One of the greatest cartoons ever made. Period. Then the hiatus happened, and they came back in 2006, or 7, and then from there on, it was a kid's show, and it was garbage. <laughs> it's a giraffe! <laughs> The best part about if I get world record on this run is going to be the commentary and the chat. Just like, wow, you know? The Krusty Krab pizza is the pizza. Do 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 pizza, do 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 pizza. <laughs> Did you just say? Chocolate. Uh, hello. Thank you. Chocolate. 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 Favorite SpongeBob episode? Go. I need to know everyone's favorite SpongeBob episode right now. I have to know. This is vitally important. <laughs> Get gruff, yes. Wait, follow me. Putting you on the spot. I'll tell you mine. Mine's wet painters. Hands down. Wet painters, dude. Anchor arms. <laughs> Yeah, Magic Conch, uh, that one, what's that one called? Uh, Club Spongebob, I think is what that one's called. Oh, the idiot box? Yeah, idiot box is pretty good, dude. That's the one where they have the, the TV box. Yeah. Imagination. Band Geeks. Band Geeks is dope. Uh, trusty Krusty Krab training video. What else? This is a bad cabin. Yep. Hold on, I'll read that in a second. Wait. Follow me. 
Uh, taste square to blow bubbles, yeah. Stomp on your right foot, don't forget it. Shanghai. Shanghai's a really good one. We have to go through the perfume department. <laughs> Perfume department, dude. <laughs> Suds. Little, little, little. Ow. Oh. Ah. Little, little, little. Oh, you know what one of my other like top five ones is. Um, the secret box, dude. Oh my gosh, secret box. <laughs> Dirty Dan is another one, yes. Dirty Dan. The hibernation episode. Oh my gosh. Super good, man. Graveyard shift! Yep. With the Hashling and Slasher, dude. Hashling and Slasher is dope. Number one horror film uh, villain. Hashling and Slasher, hands down. Okay, we're good. I say that. But... Alright, yep. <laughs> Pulling the string of the secret box to reveal an embarrassing snapshot of SpongeBob at the Christmas party! <laughs> oh, Sailor Mouth. Krabs is a. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Crabs is a eh. <laughs> Squidward smells bad or good. He puts good. Squidward smells good. <laughs> Wait, that's what it is. It's like oh, someone forgot to finish this one. Nice. The panty raid. Panty raid. You mean like girls? Girl girls? Are you okay and raiding their panties. <laughs> or raiding their drawers for their underpants. Oh yeah. <laughs> well, count me in. <laughs> Smitty Werbin Jaeger Van Jensen. He was number one. That should be like a requirement. Like, in order to be in my chat, you have to at least come up with like one SpongeBob reference. <laughs> or no SpongeBob. <laughs> Spongebob only chat. Let's go. <laughs> Today we're serving a uh -huh, patty with a side of uh -huh, fries. <laughs> why, why is this guy, uh, or what is it? He's like, this guy's talented. He doesn't have to work blue. <laughs> The best time to wear a striped sweater is all the time. <laughs> Wait. The soda drink out. Nah, Foxy Grandpa, dude. Foxy Grandpa. That's where it's at. The campfire song song? <laughs> I 
The campfire song song. Wait. The one where uh, he tries to give Gary a bath. And there was like that hint of adult humor in there that like kids wouldn't have got. He's like, look Gary, a treasure map, a pirate treasure map. And they're like, alright, let's go find it. And then they go find, you know, they're like, oh look, here it is. Oh look, doubloons, and they were soap. And he's like, don't drop them, and then he winks at them. It's like, dog. Come on. <laughs> F is for fire that burns down the whole town. U is for uranium. Bombs. N is for no survivors. When you... <laughs> so, no, not like that. <laughs> Oh man, SpongeBob is life, dude. I don't know what I would do without SpongeBob in my life. <laughs> that's a good one, Suki. Oh, that's a good one. That was really good, actually. I thoroughly enjoyed that meme. Thoroughly. Oh, I hate these guys, dude. Might as well. I'm already in here. Oh! Well, I just lost so much time, you guys, because of that. So much time. That really sucks. I lost literally probably a good ten or more seconds because of that. Oh, I'm so angry. And I was wa as I was walking in the key room, as I was walking in, I was like, you know what I should do, man? I should totally switch to a grenade that's not my running grenade, just in case those guys are bunched up in that tunnel. So that I can throw it at him. And guess what I didn't do? And guess what happened? That upsets me so much right now. Wait. Oh my gosh. Like, I'm so mad about that right now. I'm so salty. I'm turning into salt man. Like carp. But not really. It's, it's alright. But I just knew. Like, I knew that was going to happen. I, I was just like, man, I should totally do this just in case. And then, uh, didn't do it. Whatever. Oh yeah, Salty Splatoon, dude. One of my top, top five. Top five, dude. For sure. <laughs> yeah, so. Had a bowl of nails for breakfast. <laughs> yeah, so. <laughs> Without any milk. Oh, go right ahead. Sorry to keep you waiting. Squirrel in the time machine. Yes, SB129, baby. Future. <laughs> what the flip? Oh, sorry. Go right on ahead. Like, please don't open the door. Okay. Okay, good. That'll work. Okay, good. Thank gosh, she didn't get. Stuck. Oh no, she's way out there. Why'd you go way out there, Ashley? Don't do it. Okay. I thought that grabber guy was coming. What are these guys doing? Oh no, this is not good. This is not good at all, y'all. This is bad. Alright, Ashley. You can get up now. Okay. Wow, I'm losing like 15 seconds on this chapter, y'all. Literally. That's not like an exaggeration. I'm so upset. Watch out for me. <laughs> Dumb old Texas. <laughs> oh no. Why am I losing so much time? Please. Please tell me. Enlighten me. I need to know. Yeah, I don't want 
want that. Oh, I didn't switch it to Wumbo, dude. Stupid. Hi, Wumbo, you, Wumbo, he, she, Wumbo. Come on. It's it's first grade. Like, I'm stupid, man. I should have known. Like, should have known, man. I'm such a such an idiot. <laughs> you like Krabby Patties, don't you, Squidward? Man, I'm losing so much time on this chapter, though. Uh, it's really upsetting. Come on. This one. This one. There it is. <laughs> Man. So much time loss. If that's the only time loss I have throughout the entire game, I will be A-OK -okay with that, though. Oh, I may not lose quite as much as I thought. I said 15. It may not be 15. Okay. It's pretty close, though. So that's pretty bad. That's really bad. Key room annihilated me. Oh, yeah. Didn't I get shwasted by... Did I get shwasted? No, I didn't on that last run. I didn't get killed by the bugs. I went straight through. It was smooth, I remember. However, Red Zealot, I can save time. I can save time on Red Zealot, y'all. Red Zealot. Crap. Crap. I'm getting hit. I'm getting hit right here. Oh! Oh, so luck. So much luck. Okay. The luck was good. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. This is my last run for tonight, yeah. It's gonna be a no reset. No matter what, like even if it turns out to be not world record like base. Oh no, dude! Dang, dude! Suckage, man. Okay, well, at least I got that. But... Dang it, dude! <sighs> Be risky. All right, let's go. Had to risk it for the biscuit. Yeah, Red Zealot was really bad last time, so I can I can at least like save the time I just lost from the bugs with that. So that's okay. So theoretically, I shouldn't lose any time really on this chapter as long as I do Red Zealot correctly. But we'll see. We will, let's see. <sighs> Alright. Let's hope for not suckage this time from me being stupid and stuff. Make sure this time. Okay. So, that's, that's good. We should be in there. Perfect, perfect Red Zealot dude. Kept my dipping and everything. Cool, excellent, alright. I might get shot right here. Oh, good. Okay. We're straight, we're straight, y'all. I'm gonna make sure he's down because I don't trust him. I also don't trust that guy. I could potentially run past both, but I do not trust them. Excellent shot there. I don't know how that didn't work. <laughs> you mean she puts on airs? 
That's just fancy talk, dude. Okay. So the rest of that was pretty good. Besides the bug part, I should not like lose a whole bunch of time here. I shouldn't lose hardly anything. I hope. But we'll see. I think from now on, though, key room, I'm definitely going to uh, switch to a non-running grenade. And be ready to throw it when I get outside, because that crap is really stupid. You know? Like, really stupid. I literally lost... 13 seconds just from those guys in that hallway and I almost forgot to dip and that would have been hilarious. Last time I had like good dog pattern too. I don't know if that's gonna happen again, but we're gonna see. Okay, cool. Excellent. All right, let's let's hope for not losing time here. For losing a lot of time, anyways. If I do lose some, I may lose some, but hopefully it won't be a lot. Okay. Somehow I glided, even though I got hit in the Novisa Novi area. Advanced darkness, dude. Yeah. Because in RE5, there's a section in Chapter 2-2 two -two that's literally pitch black. And we call that section the Advanced Darkness from uh, that episode where he goes to uh, Rock Bottom. <laughs> this isn't just regular darkness. This is Advanced Darkness. Alright guys, perfect, let's go. Oh wow, whatever, just gonna keep it like that. I'm gonna lose probably three seconds on this chapter now because of that. So yeah, I'm gonna lose time on this chapter unfortunately, but that's alright. No, what the? Well, I'm losing more than that now. I'm losing like five. I hit B and nothing happened. She didn't get off the, the thing, so I don't know. I don't know what that was. Feels bad when you lose time on the Ashley chapter. Because there's like nothing in this chapter. The first part I can understand where the guys are, but like where I'm actually having to like save Ashley and get her to the key door and stuff, but like the other part, nah. This part, shouldn't ever lose time on this part, but you know, <laughs> exactly. You done messed up, AA Ron. Take myself over to Oshak Hennessy's office for what I've done.
At least I had really good, like, actually movement in this area. Like, that actually movement was really good. I feel like, so. Okay. Yeah, Key and Peel is amazing, dude. I love Key and Peel. Key and Peel is sick. Basically the modern day Chappelle show. And I love Chappelle show. <laughs> but la, K. <laughs> Jaquala. <laughs> oh my gosh, why do I keep doing that? And the Discord's back. Nice. Please hit A on that. Oh my gosh. So apparently if you change your resolution, Discord just comes up. That's that's what that is. That's that's how that happens. Wait, follow me. Oh, I missed it. Sorry. But la, K. D nice. <laughs> Timothy. Let's see, what are some of my f favorite skits from Key and Peele? The, the I said B one is pretty funny. The slap A one is pretty funny. Yes, I saw Dave Chappelle on uh, SNL. I had to watch that, man, for sure. I'm a huge Dave Chappelle fan, so I definitely watched that. Like, I haven't seen Walking Dead, so, like, you know, the whole, like, I, I understood what it was. Like, I had, like, a friend explain to me, like, what the scene was in Walking Dead that he was making fun of. And I was like, alright, but it didn't matter, because it had all of his characters in it, so I was like, this is perfect, I don't even care what this is. Like, <laughs> what was that one part? He's like, this is Trump's America now, and he's like, you're dang right. <laughs> I like what's his face uh the white dude Chuck Taylor and that his name the character's name the news anchor dude the old pasted pasty dude <laughs> Chimera skip, dude. Yeah, I skipped it, dude. Can't you see? You just put in all the pieces and you skip the wall. Wait. That was a terrible turn. What is going on? What in the heck was that, y'all? That was really bad. Oh my gosh, turn around, dude. I'm so sloppy right now. This is bad. Yeah, this run's not gonna record, y'all. Guaranteed. Like, there's no way unless I get some kind of miraculous, like, turnaround where... I don't know where I, where else I can save time. Oh! Actually, I do know a little time save. I know a, a small time save. Besides, like, 5-4, because 5-4 was pretty good. <laughs> Frustration in Cocoa Butter, yep. Yo, we took a, took a hanger. Put it on the stove for, like, 40 minutes. But no, I can save time in the Gigante room. Remember how I messed up a uh, double Gigante area? I can save time there. Wait. A little bit. Not much, but a little bit. Um, trying to think if there's anywhere else I can save time potentially. Everything else is pretty good in the run. I can maybe save a little bit on Salazar if I actually do a good Salazar. But that's iffy. I got Salazar, it was a bad one, but I got it. So... 
Yeah. So that's not gonna save me. But maybe a couple seconds if I can get a really fast Salazar, that is. Resident Evil movie? Yeah. Believe it or not, I've never seen any of those. I've seen, like, bits and pieces of the first one, but I was like, this is not, like, the actual story of Resident Evil. I don't know what this is. <laughs> so I kind of just didn't watch them. I was like, this is, like, fake Resident Evil. Like, even though I haven't played the first games, I at least know that the story is not that in the movies. <laughs> so... Vendetta, that's what it's called. It's a weird name, I guess. I don't, I don't know. All the, all the zombies have like the V for Vendetta masks on and stuff now. Oh, 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 oh. the CGI ones. Yeah, the CGI ones are dope. I've seen like, uh, what are the two that have Leon in them? Like Degeneration and Damnation, or is that what they're called? I think. I've seen those two. But I didn't know there was like a new CGI one, so. Yeah, those are those are sick. I'll watch those all day, but I was talking about the live action ones. I thought that's what you were referencing. That was my bed. Oh, comes out this year. All right, I'll be on that. I'll watch that for sure. All right, where's this guy at? Okay. Oh! Wow, you guys. Well, that's time loss. Freaking stupid. Why was he... Like, usually if he's up that far ahead, you just run past him. But he, like, grabbed me super fast. That was really interesting. I don't think I've ever had that happen before. Yeah, that was, that was weird. Nice link to the trailer. Sweet. Ah, well, we're losing time on this chapter for sure now. Definitely, because I mean, like, I already messed up earlier, but definitely now. I'll probably have. I'll probably come out of this chapter and be like even. It's gonna suck. So the only time saves I'll have left are Gigante and Salazar, and maybe a. Incredible 5-4. If I get a, like, ultra stupid amazing 5-4, that's the only way. It's gonna suck. That's that's asking, like, a lot, dude. Depending on, like... I don't know. It sucks that the runs come down to this, like... That I'm scraping for time now. Please don't do it. I knew it. Oh wow, he was way up there. <laughs> he was really far up ahead for some reason. That was kind of cool. <laughs> Gigante. What are you, some kind of Spaniard? No, I'm just kidding. But you do have people in Mexico, so you probably know. You probably know more than I do. I'm just one of them dad during Oklahomans that don't know none. I know American. I speak American, alright? <laughs> Not English, American. Okay. Well, 
here it goes guys here's where the run gets real now I basically have to play perfectly and get a good 5-4 aha full-blooded Mexicano I've got two cousins that are half Mexican and an aunt who's full blood Mexican. I'm an idiot. <laughs> well, remember that time save I told you all about? <laughs> Never mind. And that did not hit him, did it? Okay. Okay, okay. Okay, that, okay, that works. OP, OP. <laughs> what is this reverse pyramid? Like, <laughs> one of them lived? Oh my gosh. You've got to be joking me with that, dude. One of the bugs actually lived. Well, this is terrible. This is not good. Oh, please. Holy crap. <laughs> How did he live? Okay, that got all of them, so that's perfect. Okay. Come on, come on. Okay. Well, see, I wasn't aiming. I don't want to aim for the boulder. I want to aim at the guys back there and hit the boulder because I don't want them to hit me or grab me when I go past. So that's why. But. Minuscule time save. I guess I can't complain. It's still a time save, I guess. Whatever. There's a spot on the wall you want to hit that hits them and the boulder, and that's. I just aim too far over to the right. No one will notice? Yeah, you're right, dude. Let me just turn it on really fast. I'll just turn on the loader mover real fast. You're absolutely right, dude. Okay. I'll most likely lose time on this chapter as well. I'm going to lose probably a good two seconds. Crap. I hate that. Okay, good, got him to sidestep. Okay. Please don't be there. Alright, sweet. At least we got good pattern. Okay, cool. <laughs> yeah, I know, right, dude? I'm so good. Yeah, dude, I'm only good at doing maxi skip. I can't actually hit the boulder. Like, I'm not good at that, so... Are you gonna give me the load remover or what? Okay, cool. Yep, that way I can actually do a run with it. Let's see what's up. All right, now we sit here and talk about SpongeBob for a good like what three minutes. So yeah. <laughs> So yeah, um, you know, there's plenty of things people could be doing on a Friday night, but you guys decided to stick around and, you know, hang out with me, so just want to thank you guys for that. It's cool of you. <laughs> Bubble blowing. Alright, let's see if I can get the 
the Ricky Plank. Here we go. Ricky Plank time. Got it. Alright, cool. Got the guy to not come in here. Just what I want. Excellent. Good. Good. It is fun hanging out, you're right. You guys are right. Never seen this gun. Did you did you play it on GameCube? Um, if you only played it on GameCube, it's uh, that's probably why. <laughs> this gun uh, only came out on the PS2 version and every version after that. And the way you get it is you uh, you just beat professional mode, and it unlocks it for you, and you can buy it for zero dollars. <laughs> it's literally the most OP thing you'll ever see in your life. <laughs> But that's okay, because GameCube is by far the number one best version of the game. Steam is the second best, but GameCube is by far number one. Like, I don't care what anyone says, you're wrong. <laughs> if you don't, if you don't like, uh, if you don't like GameCube, then you're wrong. Ah. <laughs> uh... A lot of people, especially when, like, RE4 was submitted to, um, marathons like GDQ and stuff, they always complain about New Game Plus being too easy and such a boring speedrun to watch. And I will give it that, it is a very boring speedrun to watch. Perfect. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> Jade Hog. <laughs> that was dope. I'm gonna go ahead and dim in here. I think it might be faster. But, um... But, uh, yeah, there's a lot of people that think New Game Plus is just, like, super easy to play. And with all the weapons, you could think that. Like, oh, yeah, all you, you have infinite weapons and stuff. That's so easy, you know? Like, well, yeah, but there's so much skill in the run, too. Like, oh, no. Okay. That was totally worth it to turn around and hit that guy. Especially now, because I only have one guy right here. Sweet, dude. How'd that work out? <laughs> that was perfect. Like, yes, it's easy to not die. And yes, it's easy to kill enemies. But to be fast at the game? No. It is not easy. At all. So. There we go. Okay. Hopefully I can get a good Salazar this time. I don't know, I've been choking on Salazar recently. Like, not choking to where, like, it's completely bad, like... But... It's been... Iffy. Oh my gosh. That was terrible. It really is. New Game Plus is the better run. Because of... RNG factors. For sure. Like... What do we got? Okay. I have a feeling he's gonna throw another one here in a second. I'm gonna be really mad. Okay, we're good. <laughs> yeah, the new game runners started to see, like, oh, maybe New Game Plus is better. <laughs> new game is just like, it. yes, it takes a lot of skill, but it takes even more luck. While 
new game, we eliminate old, or new game plus, we eliminate not all RNG, but we at least cut out a good chunk compared to new game. So it's a lot more skill based, I would say, on new game plus, because you have to be like really fast at your inputs and everything else. It's very, um,. I don't know the word. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. <laughs> but you get the point. I love that follower alert so much, y'all. I hope you guys do too, because I think it's amazing. Sure, let's do it. Well, that was basically like a perfect Salazar. So there's that. I feel like this run's gonna come down to the wire. It's gonna all come down to 5 4, and I'm gonna be really upset about that. <laughs> Okay, I saved a crap ton of time right there. Why did I save so much time? That gives me hope. That gives me a lot more wiggle room now, y'all. So this thing may actually happen now. I don't know. It all depends on 5-4. And if I don't, like, screw up this glitch and, uh, laser. Okay, there's one. <laughs> one glitch down. <laughs> And if I don't mess up knife fight somehow, which on Steam I shouldn't because, you know, you just spam everything and you get it. But there's always that possibility where I could just eat an input. You never know, man. I'll read your stuff in a second, y'all. This is like kind of a gauntlet of movement right now, like where I have to like pay attention to my movement, so. Sorry. You're not supposed to be lax. Yeah, you're right. I got this. Thanks, man. Thank you. Yeah, you gotta be aware at all times, because, I mean, you can die at pretty much any moment. Yeah, past Del Lago, you can pretty much finish a run, like, pretty easy. You're right. Stupid Ozai. So if you guys don't know, that guy in the furnace is named Fire Lord Ozai. I actually have a couple different names for people in the game. But that's definitely Fire Lord Ozai, so. You have you guys firebending back? You're absolutely right. Pretty good puzzle. Yeah, Ricky Bobby. <laughs> we got Ricky Bobby, we got Usain Bolt, we got Fire Lord Ozai. Um, if you play um, Assign Maeda, we have Frieza. Um, what else? I know there's a couple others, but... Oh yeah, I've seen Legend Korra like three times fully, and like last year I've been here like five times. It's uh, my favorite anime series, even though it's not quote unquote anime. A lot of people argue that I consider it anime because it's not a cartoon. It's not like SpongeBob. It's an anime. Dang it. Even though it wasn't made in Japan, it's an anime. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Book three of Legend of Korra is the best one, in my opinion. Zaheer is my favorite all-time villain of anything ever. Like, doesn't matter. Movie, video game, anime, doesn't matter. He's my favorite villain of all time. Second favorite is Younger Tagoro from Yu Yu Hakusho. And Yu Yu Hakusho is my favorite Japanese 
Anime, probably. It's either that or DBZ or One Punch Man. I'm most likely going to save time on this chapter as well, as long as I don't get hit um, at the very end whenever I'm coming back up. Because I feel like this has been a really solid chapter 5-1. I'm cutting that a little close, aren't I? With that shot. <laughs> yeah, so here was sick, dude. Oh, this area is terrifying. The first time you play it. Regenerators and Iron Maidens everywhere, dude. It's terrible. <laughs> You're like, oh my gosh, please. Alright. Let's see what we can do here. Okay, good. Perfect. Should save a little bit of time here, but we'll see. Thanks, dude. I'm glad you uh, agree. I'm glad you like the same stuff. I glotted, but I didn't save any time. <laughs> Told you it was going to be a good chapter. Sweet. Okay. Alright, perfect. Perfect. I like it. That hallway can be troublesome sometimes, y'all. Believe it or not, I mean, it's like a simple hallway, but man, sometimes it causes you a lot of trouble if you do it wrong. It can be really bad. Dude, I know, right? That was the sickest thing ever. And that, you know what's funny is, like, that was the episode they took it off of uh, Nickelodeon. They're like, oh, okay, we're taking this to web only because uh, <laughs> this is uh, kind of adultish. <laughs> and then you see, like, freaking. Um, Uh, hold on. Wait, follow, wait, follow, wait, follow, wait, follow me. You see a uh, Pali get her head freaking blown off. Like, okay, yeah, we gotta, we gotta go ahead and put this on web only, y'all. <laughs> so sorry, no more Nickelodeon for y'all. <laughs> Do you guys know that SpongeBob was originally gonna be on MTV? It was supposed to be like a Beavis and Butthead, and then they didn't get the the contract for MTV and instead got it for Nickelodeon. So, uh, they ended up having to change, like, it from, like, adult humor to, you know, kids, more kid-oriented, but that's why it has, like, adult humor mixed in. Do you guys know that? This is a bad room, y'all. Okay, at least she came forward for me. That helped a lot, actually, so that's good. I'm gonna go ahead and throw this. Grab her. Come on. Come on, Ashley, please. Good, 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 good. No time loss. We're good. I hate that, dude. Oh, no. Are they up? Are they up and moving? Okay. No one's over here, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, they are up and moving, though. <laughs> oh, God. Wait, follow me. Wait. Sorry, guys. I'm kind of in concentration mode. That's why I'm, like, not talking. Hope you understand. Kind of critical that I pay attention. All right, Ashley. Is Wayne Brady gonna have to? <laughs> uh, Raquel, what's this? Wait. Mr. Franklin's lonely. <laughs> sorry, Daddy. What you mean, sorry, Daddy? Okay, now I can talk. Now I can pay attention. So if you want to talk. I'm gonna try and get the cutscene skip. If I can get some guys to drop some ammo this time, that is. Last time they didn't drop any for me, so. go ahead and let him jump up so I can kill him. Maybe he'll drop something. Sweet. It basically comes down to 5-4. Yeah. It all comes down to 5-4. I play on... 
I mean, I've played every console. So, yeah. The ones I, I actually, like, care about, though, like, the records I care about, um, are, like, Xbox was cool back in the day, and then, like, I kind of moved on from that. Like, I had that record for a while. And then I, you know, moved away from that. There's only, like, maybe five records I actually wholeheartedly care about. And that is... Um... Kind of Steam 60. It's kind of a meme, but at the same time, it's kind of okay to run, you know? It's pretty cool. Whatever. It's fast, so... Um, what just blew up? Something blew up. Okay. Um, Steam 60, Steam 30. Sign my ADA. Hold on. One Mississippi, two Mississippi, three Mississippi. Oh, I was picking up the other one right when, dude. Oh well. But, um. Seems 60, seems 30. Assignment Ada on 30 on PC. GameCube NTSC, GameCube Pal. Those are the only ones I, like, truly care about. And so, I'm starting on Steam to get those done because when I move to GameCube, I'm gonna plan on staying there for. Pretty much ever and never go back. <laughs> but, um, and then I'm gonna go to USB loader, GameCube USB loader, and that's gonna be the one I for sure do for like a really long time. Like, that'll be the one I stick with forever, pretty much. Three missiles! <laughs> exactly. Yo, look at my sum of best segments, y'all. Look at my sum of best segments. I just noticed that. Like, that is really good. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to grab the TMP ammo. It's too high! It's too high, y'all! I can't do it. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> yes, I actually have it on the Wii U. I have it on my Wii and my Wii U. I can play GameCube games on my Wii U if I want to. Which I actually need to test to see if that is actually faster than using the Wii uh, with Homebrew. That is one thing I have to test. And Wipe, I still have my um, I still have my uh, Japanese copy that I need to test out as well for Super Dipman and stuff. Yep, it's gotta be, dude. It has to be world record now, y'all. Has to be. If I get the Wii 5.4, like, <laughs> I really do have to get a pretty decent 5.4 though, y'all. I actually do have to get, like, a pretty solid 5.4. <laughs> That's not a joke. Like, I can't save any more time. I, I can only lose time at this point. I literally can't save time. Unless it's in 5.4. I can both save a lot of time in 5.4, maintain the time I have, and lose all of it. That's what 5.4 is at this point. Okay, at least I got myself a little wiggle room now. Alright, yeah, I'll update every- like, of course, like, whenever we get everything figured out with the USB loader stuff, we're gonna make a video about it on RE4C, so that people know, and like, know how to do it, and have the resources to do it and such, because we want to make GameCube USB loader, like, the new category like the new 100% like everyone plays it category you know besides steam like the only two platforms we want people to play are GameCube USB loader and steam that's it because with the USB loader like super 100% fair because you, everyone gets the same amount of loads same load times no disc like messing up anymore then with the GameCube the load times were so inconsistent and now with the USB loader, they're not at all. <laughs> yes, an infomercial. Yeah, like I said, wipe. I'm gonna have to. I don't know how we're gonna test that. I guess I'm just gonna have to do a bunch of one ones and see if like I get, you know, segmented runs, one ones on both, and see like what kind of times I get for both. I. That's the only way I can think of doing it. I don't know. Just segmented stuff. America! That's all. Heck yeah. Leave Ashley out of this! Oh, I needed her to buy Sadler's trust in me. 
Like you, I'm American. America. PS4 is actually the fourth worst console to play on. It's not, yeah, it's not good. It's better than Xbox One, but it's definitely at the bottom of the barrel. Best one's GameCube, second best is Steam, third best is 360, for sure, in that order. And then after that, it's probably Wii U, and then Wii. And then PS3. Yeah, if it doesn't have Super Dipman, that'll be awesome, dude. That means we can just use, like, Nintendo, and Enough talk. Die, comrade. it'll be way easier on everyone. Like... Okay. No knife fight incident, so that's good. Well, if it isn't the bitch in the red dress. Worst system's either going to be like PS2, PC07, or Xbox One. Like, I say it's PS2. It's by far the slowest. The PRL doesn't work like it's like it does on these. It's just one single laser. You have to aim it. It's just like all around bad. I don't know. Super Dipman is like okay. When we were first figuring out how to do the USB loader stuff, we were using Nintendo. And when you load the game in on Nintendo, um, after like you game reset or load again. It makes you and the enemies and everything in the game run literally twice as fast, except... Hold on, let me, practice, let me do this real quick. Except for the in-game timer. Everything runs twice as fast except for the in-game timer. In-game timer stays the exact same. So say you start a 1-1, right? And there's that typewriter in that little hut over there. Say you, you run in and do it normal and you save and say you get like 35 seconds, right? Game reset, get the Super Dipman, do the exact same thing you d just did, running twice as fast. You go over there to that typewriter, and you're at like 15 seconds. So the in-game timer is still going the same speed, but everything else is fa faster. And so we're like, okay, this isn't good. So we had to figure out a way around that. So we tried to use Dios Mios, and that did the same thing, gave us Super Dipman, we're like, okay. And it's funny, you can do Dipman on top of the Super Dipman, and it's ridiculously fast. But anyways, so we ended up finding that Devolution was the answer. Devolution is another, you know, USB loader. It ended up not doing the Super Demon, so we we're like, okay, sweet, that's our that's our solution. So that's the one we use. The problem with it though is that you have to have the disc, you have to have the game, the physical copy of the game to be able to play. Because it has to verify the game when you use Devolution the first time you use it. So say you get an uh, ISO of like the PAL version and you have an NTSC uh, whatever, like you, all you have is NTSC copy of the actual physical game, it's not going to work. Like you're going to have to get the game, the PAL version of the game to play. That's the only downside. Everything else is solid. It's got the fastest load times of the three, of Dios Mios and Nintendo. It's amazing. It's simply amazing. The basically the inventory times become like 360 times, if not like a little bit slower, maybe. It's um, it's crazy. So like all the places we were were used to not dipmining on GameCube, you can now dipmin because it actually saves time. All the loads are completely uh, fluid and like they're not like all over the place, like you know terrible loads and stuff. Um, you don't have to disc swap anymore, you just like hit the uh, the arrow as if you were going to eject a disc out of your Wii, and it switches for you automatically. It's really nice. Is this run any good? No. This run's actually not good at all. Yeah, the only downside is the disc. But I mean, if you want to get a, if you want to buy one to get around that, I mean, you're getting good loads, you're getting everything perfect, you know. It's and because I have a copy of all three, I have NTSC, I have PAL, I have the Japanese version. It doesn't matter for me. And what's funny is like with Nintendo, the um, you know, it gets you Super Dipman. 
But for some reason, when we tested it, it didn't give you Super Dimmon if you're using the NTSC copy. Like, it was only PAL in Japanese, I guess. We haven't tested Japanese, but it definitely did it on PAL. And we're like, okay, well, this isn't viable then. We're going to have to, like, get one that works for all three, you know? And we're like, okay. And so we tried Devolution on NTSC and PAL, and it worked for both. So I just got to try J, and uh, if it works, we're in there. Yeah, if we didn't allow USB loader, you'd need the game anyway. So it's basically just like buying the game to do the run, you know? But you're using it on USB. So, there you go. Perfect. Good statue. My camera didn't change, which was kind of weird. Usually the camera like moves up a little bit, but it didn't do that this time, so that was interesting. All right, didn't get shot that time. That was good, that's a little bit of time save right there. Not much, but a little. Oh, sorry, I just saw, like, there's a comment, something about PS4, what now? Three hours, man. Yeah, I mean, the record for Xbox, which is slower, or for Xbox Three, uh, Xbox One, is, like, a 128, I think. Is that right? You know, 128? That can't be right. I can't remember. 120... 26? 5? Set? Something? <laughs> I don't remember. But... Yeah, you can definitely beat it faster. Well, it depends. Are you doing new game? New game plus? I don't know. But you can you can beat it faster on either. So that's whatever. Well, here it goes. Pray for me, y'all. Yo, did you see that? That arrow, like, not that arrow, but the other arrow totally got hit, like, by, uh, the machine gun. <laughs> that was crazy. Like, it was coming to hit me, and the machine gun saved me. That was ridiculous. For Xbox One? No, there's no way, dude. I'm pretty sure Sunblade got a better time than that. Pretty positive that... Go to the RE4C uh, Twitch page, y'all, and there's a leaderboard there, and it has it's like a full, complete leaderboard. It has more times than speedrun.com does. Oh, no. Okay, that's okay. I'm not gonna be able to push this door now, now, but okay, yeah, I did get it down, but that's fine, whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and play it safe with this. Alright, Mike, give it to me, baby. Oh no, he's giving me the good one, isn't he? Oh, Mike! Oh, Mike, I love you. I gotta hurry. Okay, we're past. Hurry up, Mike. Thank you. I love you, Mike. Alright, do I try for the strat, y'all? Do I try for the flash thing? 
I don't think I do. I think I just PRL at this point. Just so it's guaranteed. I'm just gonna PRL. Not gonna be stupid. Well, it's just PRL. I'm not, like, this isn't, like, the god run. I'm not going for, like, something that's, like, a 122. Let's just make sure I get this one, you know? Let's just make sure I get it. Fourth run strikes again, dude. I know. It's not normal anymore. Yeah, this is literally, like, the sixth different console that I've done this on four no reset runs on, y'all. Like, makes no sense. Zero sense. Hey, it's a nice record you got there. Just give me four runs, I think I'll beat it. <laughs> like, what? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. I forgot about that, actually. Alright. Let's go. Hopefully there's not a guy up here. I'm gonna throw this just to be safe. Okay. I got JJ too, so that was worth it. Perfect. Oh gosh, this guy. <laughs> okay, they're all underneath. Fantastic. Once again. Oh, the shield guy came up! What luck was that? What kind of luck? Oh, gross. I'm gonna go ahead and throw that. Well, that sucks. I lost some time right there, dude. That arrow was suckage. But okay, I think, yeah, I think we pretty much got record, y'all. As long as I don't have some kind of catastrophe now, like, I think we're good. We'll see. It's gonna be, it's gonna be close. I'm gonna lose some time in this chapter now, but I think it's gonna be really close. Wait, follow me. Okay, good. Okay, we're in there. We got it guaranteed, y'all. World record. As long as the game doesn't do something stupid, and we got world record. Well, guys, um, thanks for sticking through. I know this run was, like, not gorgeous to watch, you know? But at least we did it, you know? So, yeah. This has been uh, it's, it's pretty good. This is a... It was a um, very average run, but at the same time, it had some good moments. So, <laughs> bring the naked PA out, yeah? You're right, dude. Just bring him out. Worth staying up, wipe. Yep, you got to see the, like, oh, what, six different four... Fourth run, like, re no reset run. World record hype? Yeah. When will I stream again? That's a good question. I made this weekend. Um, I'm not exactly sure when. Uh, me and Carp need to start practicing some RE5 and I need to start practicing the Warriors. Um, and now that I have this record, I feel like content to start that now. So, you know, it'll probably be like practice of those rather than RE4. But, I mean, if y'all want to stop by and it'll still be entertaining and stuff, you know, like whatever. <laughs> Which console's next? I mean, definitely Steam 60 would be the next one. I'm going to try for 118 on Steam 60. That's the that's the ultimate goal for Steam 60, and that's what I want, so. One twenty three forty. As long as it's you streaming, oh, that's sweet. <sighs> Man, it's pretty good, y'all. Pretty good. Why I no check phone? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Dylan. Please don't hurt me. All right, you guys. I am going to try to find you guys. A stream to watch really fast but like I said I don't know exactly um, when I will be doing another RE4 run in particular um, but it will happen 
and I will be doing 60 next. So if you guys like 60, um, definitely come. And, and all the people that followed, um, thank you. Um, so yeah, I think what we're going to do is we're going to switch over to Maxi Lobes. He's doing some uh, RE7, just for funsies. And because you guys already watched Sterling, you might as well watch uh, Maxi. So thanks again, you guys. Have a wonderful evening. Thanks for stopping by and all the follows. Love you guys. God bless. Have a great weekend. And enjoy the Super Bowl. Victory Screech! Oh!